Hey guys, so I know I've done a video with AirPods in the past, but I wanted to take this chance to do another one. So what we have here is an AirPod, a single AirPod. There is a story about this AirPod and I'll tell it to you while we're cutting it open. But until then, let's get started. Here's our AirPod, let's cut it open. In the past, I've used power tools and some other sophisticated equipment to cut open things, specifically some electronics. But this time I just want to use a razor blade and some natural light. Hopefully we'll be able to cut this open. I'm not quite sure where to start, but I have noticed there's a seam running right here. So let's maybe start there, see if we can kind of pry it open. Sorry guys, we need more light. Okay, so we have some more light here. Might help. But that's pretty cool inside there. Over here it looks like we popped the speaker open. Now, one thing I will say is don't pay attention to the lint here because this is actually not my AirPod. What happened was we went to the restaurant, took my kids and my wife, my 14 year old went to the restaurant and she took my AirPods with her when she went. And when she left, she thought she left the AirPods there. Okay, I scooted my desk here closer to the window so that we have some more light, but this is already looking pretty dang cool. Let's see if we can just kind of keep taking apart some of these sections of it. The way it charges is it sits inside the charging thing, and this piece of metal connects to the metal in the charger, which allows it to charge. And I kind of wanted to investigate how that whole thing works. So let's see if we can pry this up and take that out. Looks like some wires here. And some glue. I don't necessarily want to rip it out this way because I feel like you probably would be able to pull it out from over here. So I wonder if we could maybe cut along this section here. Let's try that. Good razor blade is a good, powerful tool. Love a good razor blade. Come through that plastic like butter. Like butter. Maybe let's cut it from the other side too. Anyway, so my 14 year old comes home from the restaurant. She's like, Dad, I am so sorry to tell you this, but I left your AirPods at the restaurant. I called them, they don't have them. We don't know where they are. And I was like, oh crap, I don't know if we'll ever see those again, which we're really depressed about. But later on that day, or about a week later, she's like, your AirPods have turned up. I just found them in my pocket. I was like, well, that's awesome. No wonder the restaurant didn't have them, because you had them. But the funny thing is the restaurant called during that time, during that two week period, and they're like, we found just one of your AirPods. We don't know where the other one is, but we just have the one. And so we went and got this one. And I guess from what it looks like, it had just been kicking around the restaurant floor for a couple weeks. So I don't know where its pair is. If you're watching this video and you left your AirPods at the Lehigh Meters, come and get the other one if you lost this one, because here it is. This is the one you lost. This is the one you're missing. Sorry about that. So what we have up in here, we probably should have like a magnifier or something, like jerry-rig everything, but I'm just not that advanced yet. But yeah, we have some electrical circuits here. Probably some of the things that allow the AirPods to function. It looks like memory, but I don't know, maybe it is just like a tiny bit of memory. But from what I can tell, this length right here is probably the battery, especially since the charger charging mechanism is right here. We have a wire that runs along it. And that wire actually comes off really easily, see? Boom. That's what charges it when it connects to the inside of the AirPods case. And then, yeah, I'm guessing this guy is the battery. We should just cut it open just to see, huh? We disconnected it from that thing. It does look like a rechargeable battery. It's really hard, like I can't even break it. I'm not even close. It, it won't 
cut either. I'm trying to cut through it and it's just not wanting to cut. So it might be a nickel metal hydride or something like that, but it's not definitely not easy to, to cut open like the lithium ions we found in the iWatch and in the iPad. Okay, and then here we have some more electrical mechanisms, another circuit board or motherboard of some type. I don't know what any of these things mean, but yeah, there's this thing and then that transfers data, I'm guessing, to the speaker mechanism here. Let's pry open the speaker. It's gonna open that baby up. Okay, so it looks like we have the main speaker right here, which pumps audio out and shoots it out this main part of the AirPod. We have an empty AirPod now. And then we've got some other things here, the wire connected. It must come over to this guy. What I'm guessing this is, is the AirPods actually will sense whether or not you have them in. So I'm guessing that's the sensor that allows it to see whether or not it's in. Because when you take it out of your ear, your music or your podcast just stops playing or your YouTube video, if you will. <laughs> anyway, so that's in a nutshell, inside the AirPod shell. Let's break that for good measure. Just imagine that engineering that goes into something like that. That's amazing. I just think it's so incredible. And you know, Apple's not the only ones doing it all across the electronic industry. We're seeing this really cool engineering happening. So anyway, that's just really cool. So I'm happy with assuming that this is the battery, but let's see about this speaker. Looks pretty cool. Looks like it's got a magnet. Is that a magnet? It's not connecting to my blade, so it's not magnetic in that sense. Looks like this is, oh, it is. Yeah, it is magnetic, see that? Totes magnetic, totes. And yeah, look how sensitive the drum is here. It's just a sensitive drum there. I'm just gonna cut that open. See what's inside there. It's the magnet, and this whole mechanism just kind of goes up and down. So awesome, just the tiny engineering here. So that is a cut open AirPod. Let me know if there's other stuff you guys think we should cut open. Let's cut open some really cool stuff. I'm hoping to do these videos a lot more frequently and you guys watching will support that. Thanks for watching guys. Be sure to hit the subscribe button.